An army marches on its stomach. Or so the old saying goes. My clansmen have been farming and tending sheep for hundreds of years. But gathering enough food to feed an army is a different matter entirely. Without a strong economy, the meager forces that we have cobbled together will collapse again. Okay, so the main objectives of this uh, level is to gather 50 food, 50 wood, and 50 gold. Villagers can gather food, wood, gold, and stone. That you will need to create buildings, research technologies, and create soldiers. And there's a few gold deposits around. So, the first... To support the Scottish army, you will need to build up your stockpile of resources. To win, gather 50 food, 50 wood and 50 gold. So the first level... Gather food from the forage bush, click a villager. So the first level was about moving units, whereas Age of Empires is really a game about economy. So the villager is the most important. Then right click a forage bush near the blue flag. So you've got four resources, wood, food, gold, stone. The main number here tells me how many the resources. Will continue working for you, carrying the food to the town center. These numbers up here tell me how many resources I currently have, and the small number that I've got here is how many villagers are attached to that resource. The amount of food you have is shown in the upper left corner of the screen. In addition to your food stockpile, you can see your current wood, gold, and stone stockpiles. The more villagers you have, the faster you can gather resources. Assign your new villagers to gather food. So you can see here this last number refers to my population. The first one is how many units I have. The second one is my population space. And this number here tells me how many of those are villagers as you could have those militia or the, or the knights that we saw in the last level. See they carry 10 food. Great. You now have 50 food. To win, also gather 50 wood and 50 gold. To gather wood, click a villager, then right click a tree. So a tree will chop down. You can see the health bar there, 30 HP. It goes down pretty quickly, but the main the main number is this. This tells me the total value of the wood is 100 to start off, and I've chopped down 10. If you haven't found any gold coal. yet, search in the unexplored territory. Coal. So one thing that's important is that villagers can only carry one one type of resource. This this forager has eight food. Once he collects 10, he goes to the TC and drops off the food, which you can see goes up to the to the bank here. If you change resource, it will lose the food. It'll just go, it'll just vanish and you won't get that in your stockpile. So make sure you, you don't keep switching between different, different types of resources. Drop them off. But I'm going to go exploring into the black area of the map. And you can see... Good look job. for you now some gold. Wood. Good. You found some gold. So I'm going to take all these villagers and go to gold. And I've got five villagers, so they should all collect ten each, achieving the... 50 gold required. As the game progresses, you can upgrade your your economy. And villagers can carry more items. They can also walk a little bit faster. But the standard is they start with 10. 
Excellent. as their maximum we amount. Have enough gold. You're well on your way to making a city. Edward Longshanks, for all its disrepute, has shown his military tactics in Wales, England and France to be very effective, if not cruel and ruthless. He is indeed an enemy to be feared. The English sacked the town of Berwick-upon-Tweed. With that, I could call it a battle, but it was truly more of a massacre. Unless we organize our army, there will be more massacres to follow. I pray that we can be ready when Longshanks comes. So you can see here the statistics screen is here again, and we've we've covered military in the first one only a little bit, but this main one was economy, and you can see that's where most of our points are. So if you have a look here. We've collected wood, food, and some gold. Alright, but for now we'll continue on to the next level.